Hi there. It's Angelique from 2AZ Travelers and just got here to Sandal the Grill. Here it is. This is where we come in. There's actually a little entryway right there too. <laughs> Be my guest. This is a grand entrance. Check-in for Club Sandals is upstairs. Some fun swings. Let's go to the main pool. Our friendly little birds here. <laughs> we'll be hopping pretty soon. It's pretty early in the morning. We got bathrooms right over there. And actually there's bathrooms in the lobby too. The bathrooms in the lobby are Plenty of loungers. There's towel stations all over the place. There's one over by the pool area, the pool bar area. A hot tub right there too. And they recycle. Beautiful gardens. Good morning. Looks like that used to be shuffleboard. There are smoking areas on property. We're just coming upon one right now. And these pretty swings. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I like how they're decorated. Good for weddings. Morning! Good morning, good morning. <laughs> Uh, 
VHS, anyone? I think these are butler suites behind us. Two or three of the designated smoking areas that I'm aware of, but we don't smoke, so it doesn't matter to us. They did say it's a $250 fine if they catch us smoking in the unauthorized areas. But I think these are the back side of um, some of the butler suites. The side that faces the water has the tubs that are out on the balconies. <laughs> Coming up to the resort shop. There's another door you can see the Sandals logo on the building. It's just so beautiful here, all these gardens. This is a huge resort shop. It goes all the way around. Nice bench for the men to sit while the women shop. Let's go check out the dive area, the dive shop area. I think these off to the right are the millionaire suites. Oh, I hear a cat. They got their own little private walled off area. The dive shop. They have the aqua classes to learn how to scuba dive. And there's restrooms right here too, honey. Here's the pool. This is where you come and sign up for scuba diving or for snorkeling. You can get all the Hobie cats or the sea bikes, the stand-up paddle boards, kayaks. What I like about this property is they also do water skiing and they do tubing. There's the tubs. Pretty nice sweets, the tubs. There's cabanas over here you want to go.
And it seems as though when a tree dies down here, it turns it into like a little totem pole. <laughs> More towel stands, lifeguard stand. Ooh. <laughs> Getting the hobby cats ready. Here's the cabanas, real quick. I think there's also a massage cabana on this other side. There's a massage cabana. You can get a massage out here. And this is the end of the property on this side. So these are all set up for the butler suites. Butler will set you up and give you whatever you want in those. They're setting up for either a scuba or a snorkel on that Santa's boat there. And there's construction going on right now. It looks like um, that's where Kachina Romano used to be and they're redoing it. So right now they're actually sharing with the Bayside restaurant. It's two restaurants in one seating area. And we have Connect Four over here. We gotta play a couple of games of these later. And wedding gazebo. Nice wedding gazebo. I mean, on the beach. There you go. So if you wanna get married on the beach, it doesn't get much closer than that. There's little, just regular gazebos. There's like another one right over here. Nice, comfortable wedding gazebo or even just for a party for chilling. Usually this would be open right through here with the Cachino Romano. 
And I'm assuming that's what it's going to look like when it's done. Yeah. <laughs> now we're coming back up to the main pool again. We'll come on the back side of it this time. Restrooms again off to the left. These areas to the right are reserved. I'd call that like a cabana, probably, res reser reservation. There's volleyball right here. And these cool blue chairs for photo opportunities. There's vendors on the beach here every day. And here's the back side of the pool. This little area, little bridge, goes over to the bar and the, bar, the Bayside restaurant. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Thanks, how are you? That's a beautiful piece of here. <laughs> yes, you do. So beautiful. You made the hood, you made the bedroom in town. And I, I made the best jewelry. <laughs> okay. We work together, you know, so you get the hood. Mm -hmm. So what are we celebrating today? 16 well, year anniversary. Yeah, 16 year anniversary. Couple days ago. How many years? <laughs> 16. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate it. Thanks. Thank you. Respect. I even got something here. I can show you guys for your for your for your. I'm Trevor. Oh. There we go. Say it again. We, we bought one last time. <laughs> we bought it down in Montego Bay, though. Good to meet you, Trevor. Thank you. Appreciate it. You want something? What the machine make? I don't have that one. Have a great day. Thanks. Fair enough. Feet from my hand, and you can take a close look to my lady. I don't like when you stay up, you stay back too far. I don't charge you to touch and look. That's okay. <laughs> Thank you. Over here too. Have a great day. Those little cushy chairs over there. This is how we change, do the weather. Don't really lean up against that because that's no. what they just painted. Here's Perla restaurant. So this is the this is the base side and they're also doing Pacino Romano in the same at nighttime. Facility at nighttime. And then Perla sure. is tacos with a kind of Jamaican take on it. Yeah, they're really good. If you're coming here for Mexican tacos, you're not getting Mexican tacos. <laughs> It rained a fair amount yesterday, so those chairs are probably a little bit wet, but they'll dry quick. There's Bella Napoli, there's a pizza place. It's really good, they get really busy, so try to think ahead a little bit when you're going to want your pizza, because I had to wait 45 minutes the other day. It was worth it, it was good pizza. Loyalty desk off to the right, and then there's the um, island roots off to the left. You want to, your excursions. Yeah. You want to do a real quick.
and then right here where you can make reservations for some of the restaurants. This is the island notes. This is where you book your experience. And there's Bayside. There's another smoking area off to the left. Another pretty gazebo. Look at how big this one is. It's really nice. Nice wood floors. Beautiful garden setting. Look at these, all the bougainvillea. This would be a great place to have a wedding too. I'm not sure what the yellow plants are called, but even the ferns, look how big they are. Or whatever they are. Palm trees probably, huh? I think we have a little pond here, and there's I don't know if you'll be able to see them on the video or not, but there's definitely fish in there. They're just hanging out. Oh my gosh, there's a ton of them. Another really pretty gazebo. Small one, but this would be for more an intimate type of setting. Again, beautiful gardens around it. Another one of my favorite swings. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Do we want to go behind here or this way? Go well, this way and then down. Okay. I love these swings. This is the block of room we're in. So this is how we come out if we're coming from the back side the building. This is our view. We're at the end there. This is ours. It's a nice walk out. Mm -hmm. Right onto the beach. Honestly, could not be any closer to the beach. Here's another fun swing. <laughs> Romantic. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is kind of comfy. Again, right on the beach. If you wanted to do a wedding on the beach, this would be the place. Just do your vows right here. Or your vow renewals. Yeah. Or your parties. And again, the water is just unbelievably calm for being in the ocean. I mean, <laughs> You're pretty comfortable. <laughs> Sunshine, sand in my feet. There's some more of those blue coolers. So those are the reserve butler stuff. Here's the part that it's not real pretty right now, but it's going to be real nice. They're doing more additions. And Here's upgrade. a resident cat. You see the kitty? Another gazebo. Bit more construction. This is the quiet pool. There's a hot tub and there is a bar over here. Then the weather station. This is where the pool bar is and the game room area. We've got pool tables, piano bar, more connect floor. Morning. Good morning. Hey, morning. Really nice seating area here. They got Jenga. It's 
it's not probably conducive to to tall people. Yeah, it's definitely not very. <laughs> Just watch your head. <laughs> Nice coffee station. It's a nice game room. We've got um, tic-tac-toe on the tables. You can also get board, regular board games here. For this pool, the restrooms are over here. And this little cottage looking area is the sundowner. There's a little front patio on it. They do lunch and dinner. Inside, outside. And then barefoot by the sea. <laughs> Look, there's somebody waving. <laughs> Photo bomb. <laughs> we can do breakfast and dinner there. And these beautiful gardens again. And these are the Crystal Lagoon Suites. They got little pools attached, attached to them. You just walk right out from your pool right into the water. Really nice. It's quiet down here. They have showers, outdoor showers for your feet and stuff. And there's a really nice hot tub and a cubby over here. There's more of those chairs over there. Yeah. Another hot tub. We got a nice little seating area here. And this right here is the end of the property. It's a nice yeah. little quiet place right here. Oh yeah, that's warm. You got little stairs here. I didn't even notice that the other day. Walk around the pool deck. Here is the end of the yep. property on this side, and there's another little hut there. So if you walk off property, you just tell the guy. And he writes down your room number. These are really nice. These come with these come with butlers too. Again, you get the pool and the beach right here. Cannot beat that.
this is a cool little cave. We're coming up to Kimono's restaurant for Oriental Cuisine. And this is the backside of the Sundowner. This is also where Red Lane Spa is. So we're coming upon that now. We have a fountain out here. It's a regular spa. Massages, facials, etc. It's a quiet spot. They do have a little outdoor hot tub here, but Looks like um, they're not using it right now. It is full, but they're not using it right now. Here's the back side of the gym. 